shot, killed, and killed by a Milwaukee police officer in Red Arrow Park nearly two years ago. Now the family of Dontre Hamilton is suing the city. It's a story we first reported last night. The shooting was ruled justified by the officer who pulled the trigger. Christopher Manny was fired. A federal lawsuit was filed today by the Hamilton family. Jonah Kaplan is live in Red Arrow Park where it all went down and breaks down that lawsuit. Yeah, Shannon and Charles, this is the 46-page federal complaint right here. There are two defendants named. One is Christopher Manny, the officer who pulled the trigger. The other, the entire city of Milwaukee. Now, at a news conference today, Dontre Hamilton's family acknowledged this is the last fight possible in court since the DA has already ruled no criminal charges could be filed. The lawsuit claims that the whole system failed Dontre Hamilton. The right officers weren't hired, they weren't trained properly, and the investigation into his death was not conducted fairly. As for any damages, Hamilton's family says they don't want money to get rich, they want the defendants to pay as, at a, to pay as a punishment. But what we can do um, through this civil suit is make them more conscious. Um, and, and, and that's not only the, the, the police department, that's the city of Milwaukee. Um, I hate to say it, but the taxpayers have to reap what the, the police officers have sold. It's worth noting that in this 46-page document, there is no specific dollar amount that the Hamilton family is asking for. Coming up tonight at 5 and 6, we're going to dig deeper into this document, including new allegations that the officer, Christopher Manny, may have suffered from mental illness while he was an MPD officer. We are live here in downtown Milwaukee. Jonah Kaplan, today's TMJ4. All right, Jonah, thank you. Family and friends, along with members of the community, will come together this weekend to honor Dontre Hamilton. Organizers are hosting a Dontre Day on Saturday. It will include a march to Red Arrow Park, where there will be a vigil for Hamilton. There will also be food, music, and activities for the kids.